I need your attention back up here on my screen, please. Michelle Deusman spends most of her day talking about things that happened a long time ago. And how do the leaders of the early republic hold up the ideals of the preamble? To kids that, for the most part, aren't very interested in what happened yesterday. But this history teacher at McMath has found a way to battle that by teaching old things in a new way. I actually don't teach my course chronologically. Okay. So um, I teach my course through big Jackson themes. So I think that by creating these themes, it becomes a lot more relevant to kids. And unless history is relevant, they don't remember it. It takes a little more effort to yeah. teach this way. Did you think about the why? She's always thinking. She'll, she'll call me on the weekend and I had an idea. <laughs> I'll be like, oh no. <laughs> but it's usually a good one and we go with it. Tayen, thank you for being brave. But for Michelle, the effort is worth it. She was named the 2023 Texas Council for Social Studies Middle School Teacher of the Year. But that award is not what makes her a great teacher. What makes her a great teacher actually has very little to do with places, dates, or lesson plans. Michelle is a great teacher because she cares about kids. She wants them to be able to understand how they learn best and how they can make sense of the world that they live in. The part of my job that I actually love the most is it has nothing to do with content. It's about just helping kids figure out who they am, who they are in, in this crazy time period, middle school. That makes her history classes more about the future than the past. I care what subject I teach, but that actually isn't my most important, that's not my, my most important thing. My most important thing is I want to make sure that these kids get through this and on to high school and to be, can be productive adults. And that means an emotional piece too. They are, they're why I'm here. You know, they're, um, I want to make sure that they're going to be happy, healthy, and successful young adults. Okay, y'all have a great night. See you tomorrow.